Marietta, GA, Notre Dame College scored five tries in the second half of Saturday's men's D1AA National Championship final to end University of California, Davis, two-year run atop the division, 40-20. The first title game at the 2017 USA Rugby College 15's National Championships at Life University featured two schools also competing against each other for a women's division I Spring Championship, which will kick off at Lupo Family Field at 3.30 p.m. ET. The tournament is being broadcast live on the Rugby Channel. Davis enjoyed possession through the first 20 minutes as the Falcons found themselves on the wrong side of the match officials whistle for ill-disciplined play and sloppy ball handling. An attempted fourth-minute clearance in front of his own post saw fullback and eventual most valuable player Marcus Tupula kick straight into teammates at the game line for an offside call. Aggies fly half Joshua Farnsworth made no mistake from in front for an early, 3-0, lead. Farnsworth doubled the lead midway through the half as Davis kept the ball in the attacking part of the field. Lengthy defense defensive stance led to a diving over penalty around midfield a few minutes later, giving the referee no choice but to send Notre Dame lock Matthew Smith to the bin for 10 minutes. Those 10 minutes were the best of the half for the Falcons, however, and a 35th minute try to inside center Zach Foro put them ahead, 7-6. They killed off the remaining time on Smith sinning and took the slim advantage into the break. A more even-keeled opening 10 minutes of the second half gave Notre Dame some momentum, passing the ball in contact and otherwise for the type of running rugby that knocked off several D1A rugby teams the season. After an initial foray behind the 22 was turned over in the 51st minute, prop Halid Williams dummied and fended a defender for an offload to fly half Corey Graham. After stepping two defenders, he popped the ball out to Foro at the try line for the center's second try of the game and a 14-6 lead. Farnsworth was unable to send a 57th minute penalty through the uprights to draw within an unconverted try, and Notre Dame ensured the Aggies would not get closer without its say-so with a try three minutes later. Smith broke a tackle to pass the 22 and Tupula sent a skip pass in contact out to Charlie. Charles win along the touch line. The wing kept out of one tackle and beat the final defender to extend the Falcons' lead to 19-6. Despite Inokrai Kotroka finishing off an attack in the 67th minute to bring the Aggies closer at 19-13, Davis leisurely play from a deep Notre Dame kick saw a looping pass intercepted by R. O'Neill Reynolds for a 69th minute try. A well-worked break from the ensuing restart found the ball in Tupula's hands in stride, and the fullback accelerated past the defenders along the touch line to dot down, 33-13. A kick outside the Notre Dame 22 sailed directly into touch for a useful Davis lineout. Though they lost the ball forward on the wing with space ahead, an advantage was being played to the Aggies, and Dominic Burke took the ball over the try line from the 5-meter quick tap. It was too late for a comeback, however, and Graham put the finishing touches on the championship with a slick run from 40 meters for a 40-20 final score.